Yo, what is going on guys? It is me, the Ninja Viewer here, and this is actually a different kind of unboxing this time around. This is not your ordinary unboxing. This is your advanced unboxing. This is an advanced unboxing video. This time, instead of doing it from the way I usually do it to my phone and with the quality of that, this is that, usually on my bed. This time, it's going to be something completely different. I'm going to try something a little bit different, like a little bit more of a quality, more unboxing compared to the norm that I would usually do. So just keep that in mind. So just keep that in mind as well. So I hope you guys like this new style. If you do, just let me know in the comment section below. At least you can hear me though with the mic though, which is actually pretty interesting. So, without further ado, though, uh, yeah, so let's get the shit started. Uh, before we begin, though, be sure to rate the video, comment, subscribe, click that bell, join the squad, boys, and follow all my social media plugins and my gamer tags as well. And, like I said, I do apologize for the lack of videos lately, but fear not, I am going to try my best to bring you guys as much content as I can as possible. It's just, you know, with this whole thing going on right now and with the delay of Digimon and One Piece and there was no One Piece chapter this weekend. I'll probably do something One Piece related, maybe the One Piece Stampede review that I keep <laughs> keep putting off for God knows how long. I keep putting that off for like a good while. But you know, hey, finally it's it, it yeah, it, it it's in. Like like we're in. It's gonna happen. Uh yeah, pretty soon, pretty soon. It will happen, maybe sometime during the weekend, you know, like with the anime, since it is anime related. So yeah, just to let you guys know that. So, without further ado, enjoy the unboxing. Alright, so, first thing on the agenda we got here is an anime series that is on the horizon of making a comeback starting next year. Uh, already in 2021, they already announced that, and the actual OVA, I believe, I don't think it's an anime, I think it's just, yeah, an OVA of, uh, Burn the Witch, and it's from the greatest author, whether you love him or hate him, well, I wouldn't say the greatest, but certainly an author of an author, pretty much, and also he was a troll, <laughs> and also the biggest troll king of all author manga artists, and of course I'm talking about Taite Kubo himself, but I'm also talking about a... Orange haired, I guess it was orange, right? Yeah, orange haired, uh, substitute soul reaper, main character, and he's pretty much the star of this amazing series. Whether you love the character, hate the character, whatever, you pretty much already recognize him. You know, he's been talked about all around the shonen anime manga verse. How can you not know about him, even if you haven't heard the series? You pretty much kind of know what the character looks like. He's even in Jump Force, if you ever played the video game, any of the video games, Jump Force. Uh, Jump stars, you know, uh, what the, f yeah, J stars, I think, uh, I mean, not jump stars, J stars, yeah, J stars, J stars, victory plus, and all that jazz. I'm talking about the one and only, if you wanna see some action. I can't really do the whole lyrics because I don't wanna get, like, you know, copyrighted with the music. So, yeah. I mean, now again, I could do an instrumental, but. Uh, I could, I just gotta be careful with the copyright and whatnot when it comes to music. But anyways, here it is, right here. Oh, baby, here it is. Bleach in all of its glory, now on Blu-ray. Now, I decided to collect these due to the fact that, uh, with the Bleach anime coming back, I figure, you know what? Now that the Blu-rays are finally making more of a comeback, and we're getting more and more episodes on each of these sets, we could pretty much be getting a lot of these sets like within the year with a lot more episodes. I think it's like 26 or 27 episodes on each set though, which is actually really, really good compared to what they did years ago. So I'm very happy for Viz for actually making this decision. I'm also very happy for them for actually bringing it back. We also got, we're going to be up to the seventh set starting just June. Right now there are six sets out and right now especially speaking of um i'll save that for a second so here's the front and here is the back cover of it of course now let's uh well let me uh do this remember there's a new style i'm trying out so that way at least the quality and at least people can hear me because you know it's it's something new that i want to try out at least people can actually you know see it more clearly so yeah 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 first time on blu-ray with the cone cone sticker cone oh man Cone brings me back so many memories. Episodes 1 to 27. I thought I said 21. 21? But no. <laughs> it's, it's weird. There's the back of it, of course. You got 
Ichigo, Ichigo, Kodosaki. Now let's just, before we get to the unboxing, let's uh, see what we got. Ooh. A little bit spicy. That is spicy. I love it. That's actually really, really spicy. Okay, so we actually get like a full-on background cover. That is boss. We got Gin, Gin Ichimaru. Orahime, we have a uh, Chad. <laughs> yep, there we go. We got Chad Bleach. I just realized these are actually used from. Okay, if you guys remember back in the day from Biz, these were like the very old covers that they used for the old school DVDs of Bleach when they first released these in America. When they did that, they had them in like volumes. The episodes were only three episodes or something like that each. So yeah. So without further ado, now. I can actually get this unboxing started. But yeah, that's pretty much a little history lesson there for you. Actually, let me get my uh, trusty keys. That will actually help me out a bit. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Oh, shit. I hope I didn't. Now we're good. We're good. We're clean. We're clean. We're good. We're clean. We're good. All right. So let me just unbox this. Oh, unbox that. All right. All right. And there we go. All right, so let's take a look. Uh, we'll take a look what's inside this thing. Oh, okay. Hey, backwards. Uh, oh, let me show you real quick. All right, if you guys can't really see it, uh, this is the backwards uh, back. You know, the uh, side cover or a flip cover that you can do, kind of like what most of these have. It's the same one you saw from the back, except that this time it's here. Uh, I don't know. I think I might keep the back ones because they seem like a lot more. Uh, I don't know, to, in my opinion. Uh, so oh, it says you to become a soul. I think it means to say so you want to become a soul reaper. I think that's what it's trying to say. So you are to become. Oh, you are to become a soul reaper. Okay, it's like it's very very weird like, the way it's like written and shit like that. It's very very odd. But, yeah, it's really cool, too. Uh, I like that. I like that a lot. But you know what? That's really cool, and I hope all these come with that as well. So that's actually really dope. So, yeah, here we go. That is the first one right here. All right. And by the time... Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, too. By the time you see the next part of this, this is an edit because the second thing, uh, actually, what I'm going to show you next, came in first before this. So you'll actually see that coming up very soon so it was recorded in different time because it was different this one was late due to amazon you know with what's going on right now in the world pretty much is causing certain delays but now it seems like slowly but surely they're finally getting back on track with certain things so jojo fans look out maybe i'll get back to that too but we shall see on that hey you know hey you know hey this month is my birthday month hey this is my birthday month it's my party and I hype if I want to. All right, so yeah, so yeah, it's my birthday. Oh, oh, go! It's your birthday. Well, not now, but my birthday is the thirty-first of this month. So yeah, thirty-first of this month. Uh, so yeah, uh, so I figure you know what? Fuck it. You know what? Uh, I'm I'm pretty good. I got some extra money aside, and since that's gonna be the case, I figure. You know what? Might as well do that. And eventually, I don't know when, but eventually, your boy might get a brand new PC sometime soon. But I can't promise you that, though. I'm still working on the kinks of what I really want. And then, I will truly finally have it. And who knows? Maybe more content can fill in for these difficult times of need. Especially because there's no One Piece anime, Digimon, all that crazy awesome shit has been delayed for a while. So... It's going to be a rough one, especially for my channel, but we'll see what we can do. So we got to make the best of it as most we can. So anyways, now, enjoy the next half of this. Bye. Another one. Another one. Another one. Another one. Don't worry. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, now this time, uh, we're going to get to the uh, second one of this, since uh, by the time you see this, it will be there, since the first one didn't arrive first, but this one did. So anyways, yeah. So now, this is the second set to that series, since I already showed up the first. Why not show you a double? Another one, as DJ Khaled would say. Another one. Another one. Another one. 
Indian Another one. Here we go. This is Bleach Blu-ray box set number two, which has episodes 28 to 55. Actually, uh, let me just do this better so you guys can uh, hold on one second. Hold on. Then, there we go. Something new, like I said, to try out. And here we go. Here is... Oh, sorry. I just want to make sure it's still on. Uh, here it is. Bleach. Uh, Blu-ray number two. There's Rukia. And as you can tell right there. Yep. For the first time, episodes 28 through 55 with a little cone sticker. There's Rukia. And let's go to the back. Uh, right there. We got Ichigo. Ichigo. Kurosaki doing his thing. And you got the amount of episodes, of course. Episodes uh, 28 through 55. You get a art gallery clean ending plus behind the bonus scenes of Bleach interviews with the English cast. Not sure if it's an old old interview or not, but I'm not so sure. Anyways, like I said, I got these from uh, from Target. So, as I said before, uh, I got it from Target. Yeah, so I got it from Target. Uh, same with the first one. Actually, no, no. The first one I got from Amazon. This one I got from actual Target. And I would say Target shipping seem to be a lot more faster these days compared to Amazon. Well, I can understand why though, which is, you know, understandable. But uh but still though, like I'm I'm very, very surprised though how like fast this like actually came though. Like I didn't expect it to come like literally this soon though. Even though it did say it was supposed to be on its way by beginning of the week though i thought it was gonna take a little bit longer but surprisingly no they uh they didn't delay it i didn't get this uh not that long ago actually so yeah um hold on, let me make sure i didn't scratch anything uh no it should be good oh yeah there we go and i got something out oh yeah there we go uh yeah there we go <sighs> Shit. Ah. Ah. there we go all right so here we go uh Got that going right there. Oh, hold careful. Then when, ah oh, man, I want to do the the bent on that. No, no, oh, I didn't mean to do that, but it's okay. It's all right. So now we can just take it out of the package itself. And oh, cool, we got an, an inside cover. That's pretty boss. I think the first one did have one as well. Yeah. So, oh wow, this is actually uh, this is pretty boss actually. I like this. I love. Oh, I love this. This is so cool. And it's the same thing. Here, let me uh, get a closer look in that. Oh, look at that. That is so boss. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. You got Renji right there at the bottom. You have Hitsugaya. You got Rukia. You got Kampachi. And you got Byakuya. Okay, I like these because they actually represent most of the uh, the regular DVD volumes. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, these are the regular DVD volumes. They just made them like even more crispier and cleaner. With the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, uh, Blu-ray upscale. Or not the Blu-ray upscale. You'll, well, more of like a, just a better art programmer upscale for it, too. So here we go. We got the um, little thing of the Shona Jump thing. Get rid of that. Oh, cool. We get an inside cover. That's pretty boss. I can tell. We're getting an inside cover, though. That is really, really cool, man. That's actually really, really cool. The, um, you got the first disc, as you can tell right there. The second disc. We got the third disc, and uh, there we go. And you get a little um, inside cover here. I've come to save you. There's no turning back. Hell no. We've, uh, I've come here to, to get you out. And it's an actual uh, reversible cover that you can have. That's actually really, really cool. Uh, that's really nice. That's really cool. I might actually revert this. I might actually revert this. I want to actually try that out and actually see it. It's actually really, really cool. That That is awesome. That's really hot. That's okay, so let me just do this real quick here. All right, so there is the reversible cover right there. We got Rukia with the sword bloody up. And here's the message. I've come to see you. There is no turning back. Hell no. I've come here to get you out. All right, so looks pretty cool. I mean, I might just keep it the way it is like beforehand, though, because that one looks pretty cool. I might switch it back, but we'll see how it goes, though. We'll see. Uh, I still like the other one better. I think that one actually looks like pretty boss, though. So this one's pretty nice, too. This one's not so bad, but we'll see. Until then, uh, yeah, all right. So that is it for that. So now it's time for the next unboxing before we uh, pretty much wrap things up. And then, yeah, that'll be pretty much it for the unboxing. All righty. So let's do this. 
Okay, and last but not least, it is a video game unboxing. Yeah, surprise, surprise. Now, keep this in mind, there's going to be no video game unboxings for the two upcoming games, which are going to be Shantae uh, and the Seven Sirens, and uh, for the Hatsune Miku game, uh, something 39 hit, I forget. But I played the demo, and it's actually pretty fun. I'm not sure if I'm going to get the entire song pack, though, unless I could just do that in the actual game itself. I think you could also, you could just pretty much just get it like as early unlockables, if I'm not mistaken. But if I don't want to do that, then maybe I, if I don't want to get early access, I could just maybe play the songs and just unlock them that way. I think I'm just going to do it like that. Because I'm not sure if I'm going to go like the extra mile and just buy all this. Just to literally get like most of all the fucking songs. Instead of, because the game is like $40, like $39.99. But if you want to pay the extra 20 bucks, you can get pretty much some of the other songs, you know, with it as well. Unless it's a DLC deal, I'm not so sure. Put down in the comment section below if you guys know. It might just be a DLC thing. Maybe it's not just to complete the track list. But we'll see how it goes. I don't know. I don't know if it's to complete the whole track list or not. Or it's just some like extra DLC content, which I have a feeling that's probably what it is. Probably like some extra DLC content. But like I said, uh, we shall see on that. So anyways, yeah. All right. So this is actually a video game unboxing of a game that actually came out about a week ago pretty much i know it's weird that's already the first day of may well actually by the time i'm seeing it's actually not even it's gonna be the second day of may but by the time it's gonna be uploaded it's gonna be still may but it's, it's not gonna be yet though but it will be uploaded this week once uh everything is all edited and all set to go then yeah but this time this is the very last item it's a video game it's a remake of an original rpg game from square and I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Just, just, just look here, okay? Just look here. Look here. Just listen. Look here. Look here. Look. Listen. And hear me out on this, okay? It's actually a remake of a game that was on the Super Nintendo, and it had a series of its own games, but not too many people talk about it anymore. Until Nintendo announced it last year during E3, they had the remake of that, and it's also coming to other platforms like PS4. And Steam. Not sure about Xbox One though. Sorry about that, you guys. I don't know about Xbox One, but I have to look that up again. Anyways, this is the version that I got for Nintendo Switch. As soon as I played the demo, I'm like, hell yeah, I actually have to get this game because it's actually really, really fun. Even though I have like an R game I'm still trying to complete, which is Power Warriors 4. Um, well, actually, I should have been completed that by now. It's definitely almost done. Since I've been having some technical difficulties with certain parts of the new world, which I literally just started like finally, which. I'm halfway pretty much through the game already, but then I still have to do the treasure, um, uh, the actual treasure stuff to get the other characters, which is still not done. Even if I'm done with the story mode, I still have to do all that to get the other characters, but I can still make it just in time just to make the review, regardless, since I've gone through, like, the stories, like, campaign pretty much. So, yeah. So, review for that game, hopefully will be sometime soon. I have a review also for Pirate Warriors 4. Since, unfortunately... Uh, no, actually, no, I did do an unboxing, but... Maybe I'll do a review on that as well, if you guys really want me to. And another anime series I was planning to. Again, I have some ideas in mind. If I'm not too... Procrastinating, or I hate to say this word... Lazy. Then I could seriously go out there and just bam, and just get all out there as soon as I can. But anyways, yeah. So, this time, it is going to be a video game, like I said, based off a very famous RPG... Not too many people talk about it until last year, but everything's going to be there. Including a collection of the older games, but I've been spreading on way too long. Here it is, for the final, finally getting through this. Here it is, Trials of Mana for the Nintendo Switch. Trials of Mana, I'll just get a little zoom in for that, just, you know, for you guys to see. So, bam, here it is, Trials of Mana, right there. Okay, okay, okay. So, there it is. And you got the back of it. These are your six uh, characters uh, to choose from. I tried playing as this one healer girl, this little healer girl. Not a big fan of her. I don't like the fan of her dialogue. I mean, maybe it's because of the dialogue and the way she's written in. Eventually, I will play and probably just basically, like, I'll use her in, like, certain events because I know she's a healer. But I'm going to wait until possibly, uh, maybe, like, during, like, the last of the campaigns I do or something like that. Because you could choose, like, different ones. Like, it's, like, I think it's, like, 20-something hours for, like, a, the main story regardless. And I guess it kind of reminds me of, like, how, like, D&D goes. How, like, each rules will, like, will just, like, make a difference of, like, each of the stories. But that's just me, though. Because it has, like, its own 
story thing for each of these kind of characters. Like, they'll, they'll mix it up with the three teams you choose. And then all of a sudden, it's just like, yeah, they'll be like, oh, what the fuck? Then this happens and that happens. So, yeah, it's pretty crazy. So, there it is right there. Um, just unbox it. And, yeah, we'll be good to go. All right. So, let's begin. Uh, let me just get that going. All right. Um... Yeah, so anyways, like I said, uh, I don't know if that's an extra DLC thing for Hatsune Miku, but I'll double check on that. But, <laughs> but, however though, Shantae though I am excited for. It's a shame we're not getting a physical copy release of the, um, uh, the Sirens, unfortunately, which really sucks. It's only digital right now. But you can also get the full game on the Apple Arcade thing, but I don't have Apple or a Mac or wherever the fuck you use. I don't have any of that. Uh, the Steam version, which will be on PC as well. Steam's version as well will be just like the... Uh, it's, I think this is the 27th? I think May 27, May 28, some shit like that. I think it's at like the very, very end of, uh, of May, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so it should be around the end of May. But anyways, let me just get this... Uh, oh my god, come on. Why can I not do the unboxing thing? Even though I already had this... Sort of, kind of, well, I don't know. Well, I somewhat had it. Well, uh, I did have it, wasn't it? Hmm. Oh, wait, there we go. I think I just used my finger. Make that as context as you will. But anyways, um... <laughs> I was going to say, make that as many contacts as you will with that. And, you know, I guess have fun, but not too much fun. And now it's just sounding really wrong. God damn it. Okay, so, anyways, now that I got that out of the way. Now I got the, there we go. Got the plastic off. All right. Let's do a thing there. And let's see what the inside's giving us. Oh, neat. This is cool. Oh, this is fire. I like this. Oh, I like this a lot. Oh, oh, that's hot. That's hot. <laughs> oh, that's hot. That's hot. That's hot, man. That's hot. All right, so here we go. Uh, all right, let me just uh, zoom on just real quick. Okay, so we have the inside cover, which is... Uh, oh, that's hot. That's hot. That's hot. All right, look at that. Oh, that looks so cool. And you get, oh, cool, you get, like, official merchandise of, like, little figurines and shit. That's really cool. Uh, sorry about that. That's just the desk there. All right, so there we go. We have that. We have, oh, this looks spicy. <laughs> a little bit spicy. Spicy. This looks really good. Wow. And, of course, a piece of resistance. The game. Yep. All right, so there we go. All right, so that is the unboxing video um right there so i'm just gonna do a quick little recap of the stuff that we got and yeah after that we're just gonna be signing off all right so here is the wrap up here really quick just to show you guys really quick just wrap things up here is trials of mana for the nintendo switch with that and everything ball look at this look at this this looks so freaking cool i love it Oh, I still can't get enough of that. It's so good. And then, of course, the first two. Bleach sets. Bleach 1. Bleach set 2. And there we go. These are the first two Bleach sets. Just to give you a quick little recap. Now, okay. Now it's time to wrap things up. Okay. So the final... Oh, Jesus. Hold on. Fix this right here. Alright. So, final verdict overall. Uh, yeah. So that's pretty much it for the unboxings for all three of these things. Uh, there should be another one. Uh, not gonna be too long. Uh, it's gonna be like probably the third of the Bleach Blu-rays that I'm actually gonna be getting. Then I'm just down just the three more left, and I'm finally caught up with these. Uh, pretty much were the only things that were cheap that I were able to get right now at the moment. Everything else was a little bit too hard right now, but at least I was able to finally snag those two at least mainly, and especially for Charles and Mana. Unfortunately, when it comes to gaming, though, uh, most of the stuff I'm going to be getting that's new is going to be digital, but I'll see if I can fit in some reviews here and there most of the time for those since, you know, I can't really unbox them, unfortunately, which will be Hatsune Miku. There's a new game for that for Switch, and Shantae, of course, is coming out at the end of the month, so there's that I'm going to be picking up. 
So, yeah, that is pretty much it. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below on what you guys thought of the cool unboxing stuff they did. Did you love it? Uh, were you not too surprised with it or not too impressed? Whatever. Whatever your thoughts may be, just leave them down in the comments. And, yeah, I'll take a look at those when I can. And until then, that is it. So, peace, soul, love, chicken grease, and the sky is the limit. And my manga fans keep supporting what you read and what you watch right here and uh for video games remember gamer fans no game is ever impossible and that's it oh and also as ray master would say aim for the skies now i can sign up for reals.